Um, down to three cabbages left. These are all reproducing more cabbage heads. Uh, I left this because they're hard. They are actually little mini cabbages. Oh, yeah, all of them. So, what the heck? I'm going to eat them. I talked about this. Uh, you'll see in a video. Cucumbers, I have just... They need water. And I keep picking and I keep picking. And look it. More and more keep coming. My dog keeps picking them, eating them. That was her there. More pickles. More pickles. More pickles, guys. I don't know how to, like, this is like, duh, 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 duh. it's awful. <laughs> it is, but it isn't. I just don't know what else to do with pickles. I've made jalapeno dill relish. I've made regular dill relish. I've made refrigerator pickles. I've canned dill pickles. I gave away 11 pounds, and I probably have another 15 right now, plus all of these that I need to do stuff with, so. I don't know. There's that. Um, my kohlrabis are producing kohlrabis on top of kohlrabis. Basically, they're weird. I don't know. I was thinking about cutting one off and eating it and seeing what happens. Uh, my beans, I have picked them twice now, three times, and I've frozen a couple bags each time. Tomatoes are really looking like crap, but they are they are ripening. I'm going to make stuff out of them as they come, you know, and ripen. These ones I'm really liking. They're like the black cherry style. It was an heirloom one. You can see that's a really nice tomato plant. Or, not plant, tomato. My peppers are doing pretty decent. I keep picking them. Like I said, everything needs water this week. Here, I gotta show you my favorite plant. I'm like the whole garden. Here it is. Super nice and thick. But the tomatoes are doing well. There's my dog eating the cucumbers. They're her favorite. <laughs> oh, what a silly dog. So, yeah, I'm still really sad about the wind taking out my tomatoes. They, it, they look so nice before that, but it is what it is. As you can see, they are trying to bounce back. Maybe you can't see because of the sun. But they are trying to bounce back and grow again. Up, oh, so. The sunflowers. The one I tied to try to support died. The other ones are okay. So. I wanted to talk about this. I believe it's called a canna lily. And I didn't plant it. The weird thing is, I'd say five years ago, possibly six. My dog's trying to eat my cucumbers. He sit down here. Um, we grew these and alongside the house, and then I grew some down in, in a garden that I had. And I threw the stalks and like the flower, like well, they had flowered and everything. And I threw everything into our manure pile. And last fall, my husband put like 12 loaders in this, our first garden, our first bed. 12 loaders of our old manure, like aged manure on this. And look what pops up. It is a canna lily. So I'm going to dig it up and I'm assuming there's going to be a bulb or tuber, whatever it's called. I, mean, I can't even remember what they're called, but um, I just wanted to share it because I thought that was super neat that one started from seed six to five, five to six years later from being a manure, a manure pile. So, interesting, huh? Just look awful. Um, but here we are. Actually, I have a squash hanging here. They'll redden. We'll eat them. It'll all be good. I picked all the big zucchini. I got some nice small ones again. But look how tall these are. They're probably almost thigh high. 
and even with the squash bugs, they just keep growing. Like the plant itself. Now, because all the fruit is gone, it's gonna. I hope it's gonna produce more. I don't know if I want it to or not, but it will produce more. Actually, yeah, you can't really see it too much. The peppers are okay. They're taking a little hit. I think they could use some water. Watermelon's looking good. We got squash, dill, some tomatoes. This stuff is okay. It's not the greatest. Things are kind of dying back. The pumpkins are humongous. So my husband came through and actually weeded things. Um, he's trying to find a dirt pile we have back here. So you can actually see the, the, the manure pile again. Pretty crazy. So, I don't know if you can see it, but we have orange pumpkin. And let me zoom out. There's another one. Mm, kind of hiding in there. Lots of green ones and good sized ones. There. With my foot on it, you can see it's pretty big. Mm. This one, my dog decided to do her thing, I'm guessing, but size. There's another one. See it in there? There's two in there. One there, one there. A big one there, starting to turn orange. And there's one of the orange ones over there and a couple more up in there. But yeah. That looks a lot nicer. And then if you come over to our corn, it stood straight back up. Most of it did. Uh, we have been harvesting. I've canned some and I'm gonna uh, freeze some this next time around. I'll probably have another, enough to can also. But it's just, it's a lot of work to do it all. And we've eaten it quite a bit, like almost every night, but I don't mind that. I do enjoy corn. So the sunflowers are all leaning from that storm yet, but if you notice, they are starting to go straight back up again. We lay down all of the onions. We're waiting for them to dry, and then I'm going to tie them on strings. Not braid them, but like just tie them up and hang. So there's that. But yeah, all that corn stood back up. Sorry about the sun. It's not a great angle, but uh, yeah, I don't know if I can maybe I'll find it ear of corn. That's about the dryness I've been checking. I don't think this one's gonna be ready. I have a feeling it's not quite. Oh. Oh no, it's like, it's ready. Here, let me. Maybe we'll have corn again for dinner. Let's see. Sorry if it's shaken. Look at the comfrey. <laughs> Put my dogs in there. Here you go. Nice kernels. But yeah, so that's about the dryness of the tassel that I've been doing. Um, and now I think that is exactly right. If not, that's a little bit on the big side for me personally, but for canning, I would like that. So, this one here is probably ready. See the tassel on that? Yeah, that one also here. I'll pick that. You can see.
I have a mosquito bite in my bicep. So yeah, it's time to can and freeze some corn. I'm pretty excited about the onions this year. Yeah, most of them are coming out of the ground, but they're still gonna dry up. No, you cannot eat. Look at my dog. She had all the silk hanging from her mouth. Oh, he's sad. But it was a really good year for onions. No. We got so far today. Look at some of these big peppers again size of my hand and a little red one picklers nice little slicers why do they get yellow I don't really know that and why is it throughout the rest of the year they kind of get a little weird anybody know this see that now when you peel them and eat them, they're good, but like, why do they get like that? That one looks like it's a pickler slash slicer. Which it could be, because they're planted next to each other. <laughs> so, I got a couple of these. They're, I believe, a black cherry type variety, but they're not a cherry tomato. A nice size. Oh, focus. Yeah. Some tomatoes. I'm just kind of cleaning stuff up here today. Um, oh, and I'm going to put some pictures in uh, some things that got away from me. I don't know if you can see the zucchini back there. Uh, but I'll put a picture of that in that they're still in the wheelbarrow. They're probably, well, I measured one. I'll even put a picture of that. It's like two feet. It wasn't even the biggest one, two feet long. And then I had my hand like along next to it. So it's like the whole size. They're just humongous. So we picked all of them. And we have that green tote behind me is full of huge cucumbers. So yeah. He's going to ruin my shot again. Um, I'll put in a whole bunch of pictures of those kind of things and the things that I made. So we will talk to you guys later and see you at week 14. I was just going to talk about this a little bit. From what I understand, this is a resurrection lily. could also be called, called a surprise lily. But it's dying up, dying now, but I did get one nice picture of it, and you'll see that in the video with the roll of pictures I sent through. But I thought it was pretty neat. Uh, I've never seen it here before. I've never planted it. Apparently somebody has. <laughs>